hello everyone welcome back to my channel for today's video i will be doing a dior unboxing so this time this is not a dior beauty so anyway it actually came in with this beautiful beautiful box i think this is for the holiday wow the box is absolutely gorgeous definitely definitely love their motif this year oh no this year last year the ribbon is in white and gold right there i'm gonna give you a closer look and wow look at that the pattern is amazing it's absolutely gorgeous i wish they could have had this boxes all year long but anyway so I also love the fact that they change their motives every single occasion, every year. And in two, 2021, this is their motive. It is absolutely amazing. So now I'm going to show you what I've got. I am so excited for this piece. And it took me a while to make a decision whether I wanted to add this or not in my uh whether i wanted to uh invest on in this piece that's because um uh, the one that i really wanted got sold out so fast and yeah i decided to get this instead and we have oh uh, so this is the entire full look of the pattern and okay in this packaging right here oh i could just easily okay so here comes the item the item that i got from dior and it is a notebook and wow it looks actually it looks so beautiful in person on the website I was, it was a little bit like blurry in a way. I don't know. I just find it so blurry. I just could not really appreciate the uh, Toile de Joy pattern in it. But in person, it looks so beautiful. So this is how it looks. It has a Dior right there. And it is, uh, it is in gold color. So on the website, they called this toile the joy and yeah there's nothing else there's nothing else name associated to this it is a notebook made up of this christian dior signature toile de joy motif so beautiful very nice and this one is made up of cardboard so i'm just letting everybody know that this is not made up of fabric so as you guys probably have thought that I thought this would have made up of fabric because of that's what they're actually famous for with the Toile de Joy. So yeah, it is a hardcover. Let's take a look inside. Okay, very nice. And right there, this one is lined. It's made up of, it says 100% paper inside, obviously. Maybe, I'm not sure, maybe 100% a, a recycled paper. I am not. But I had a feeling that's because of the feel to it and the colors. Well, but I have nothing against with recycle. I would, li I would like to have everything recycled. And this one has 72 pages. It's, this one is lined. It has a bookmarker right here. It has Dior logo right there at the bottom. And, okay, what else? There's nothing much special on this piece. This one, it says it's made in France. Very nice. And this one measures around seven by five inches right there so let me get my louis vuitton um agenda pm and i'll give you a comparison for a size reference so this is the comparison for 
the size reference as you guys can see that the notebook from Dior is so much bigger so just to give you a an idea of how to those of you who wanted to consider buying this so at least it'll give you a lot more of an idea so now right here on the side it has a gold gold foil in it which is really nice. It actually complements really well with this red color. I wanted, initially, uh, last Christmas, I wanted, initially I wanted to get this motif right here, but they sold out. I waited for days and weeks has passed and I really wanted to get this and uh, unfortunately the website did not replenish it. So I decided, so this is my second choice. So I end up like getting this because um, most of the time they are sold out. It is so hard to get a hands on any of their notebooks. So last year, I think I missed out on last year on, on their notebook, but I really wanted to get their notebook. And also um, the price for this is around $70 comes with different colors they have it in large and sizes also they have it in gray color the toile de joy motive as well in gray color this one came in with the larger sizes and i think this one is perfect but like i mentioned earlier this is around 70 dollars if you're gonna ask me if you ask me like my honest thought if it's worth it no it's not that's because this one, they're all made up of paper and cardboard. But if this one is made up of fabric, I would say so. It's definitely worth it. But this one is just like this. Once you write something, this is not refillable like that. And I think, let me just take a look at inside. Okay. Okay, I was just more concerned if the bottom's actually glued or stitched. I don't know I forgot how to figure I've tried to figure it out but I'm I just didn't really like that the side of it are glued because well definitely we're not gonna stood uh, stood up in time if that's the case because you're constantly opening it and trying to stretch the notebook so that was just my only concern okay so anyway last year uh, Dior come up with the beautiful, beautiful motif as well for the holiday, and I totally fell in love with it. And um, for that, I decided to create a uh, my uh, DIY notebook for 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 that. And um, here is what I did for last year. It is absolutely gorgeous. It is absolutely amazing. I totally, totally love the pattern for this. I think this is one of the best pattern that Dior has come up with. And also this year is absolutely amazing, but this one is gorgeous. I actually made a notebook out of their um, shopping bag. This is from the shopping bag. And wow, it looks amazing. I totally, totally love this. If you're going to ask me to compare, you know, if you're going to ask me to compare this notebook to this, <laughs> I mean, I just don't really like to compare. The reason why I, I took, I got, I purchased this, that's because I totally love this red color, the pattern. That's why. But if you ask me to comp compare and uh, if they're worth it, it's not. I might as well as just use this right here to create a new notebook as well. Or it, it could be any sort. I have a smaller version of this right here of a shopping bag. I could also use that as a notebook. And of course you needed a shopping bag. And I know that I purchased this notebook by itself around $2. And it's totally worth it. I, it is functional. I have never used it. That's because I just use this one as a decoration. And it actually works perfectly as a decoration. I didn't write anything in this. It is functional. It is useful. You can write whatever you want. And this one is 
dotted. This is not lying, but I don't care because I'm not using it. I could use it if I want to, if I wanted to. But um, when you come to think of it, like it's actually, it feels special that you actually created a notebook out of of a uh, shopping bag and a paper bag right here. So this is a paper bag that I turn out into a notebook so that I can use with. And this is how we look inside. It I just that I think they gave me a sticker and I think it gives a little bit more likely it looks I, I kind of like it because I created myself uh, <laughs> compared to the other one obviously right there and I encourage everybody to that if you have any sort of a shopping bag from any brand that you love you could do that as well you know you could do that as well since I totally love this pattern from Dior last year so I decided to use it or add um create a notebook out from that and yeah so let's try to compare <laughs> there's two notebooks right here so this one is seventy dollars this one is around three dollars i think i think i pay taxes for this for the notebook by itself and this is the comparison but i know that you needed a shopping bag to be able to create the notebook but since i purchased something last year i don't even remember what i got and um, i make use of that shopping bag and yeah and it's totally worth it and i that's why that's the reason why i didn't even bother and i am not i don't feel like i missed out from last year that's because i created a notebook out from the shopping bag and it looks stunning right there wow i still i still love it i still feel that it's totally worth it it took me a while to create this notebook that's because the shopping bag is very delicate and yeah this is the comparison between the two and definitely you'll get more pages in here you could write a lot more compared to to the other one and if you wanted to be more creative you could paint this with any color that you wanted but I'm not really crazy about that I am just um I'm, I'm happy with what I have created actually so yeah I am just letting everybody know that if you wanted to purchase this notebook right here this is $70 and I think it's still available on the website and this is my own creation you could actually create your own DIY notebook any notebook will do any shopping bag will do from your favorite fashion houses right there but since this one is gorgeous so i decided to do the dear one and it's totally worth it so anyway that's it for today guys thank you for watching and i will see you in my next video bye